Now coming to the topic. The topic is breakdown mechanism in a diode. When the diode is in reverse by R. When a diode is in a reverse bias for a small reverse voltage, then the diode current is small and almost constant at I naught, but reverse voltage increases beyond that a limit value. Large diode current flows. This is called breakdown of diode. What is the breakdown of a diode? When reverse voltage increases beyond the beyond certain limit, large diode current flows. This is called breakdown of a diode. And corresponding voltage is reverse breakdown voltage of a diode. There are two distinct mechanisms due to which breakdown may occur in the diode. They are a valence breakdown as well as and GNR breakdown. Let us see avalanche breakdown. Avalanche breakdown occurs in light doped, lightly doped diodes as the applied reverse voltage is increased. The voltage, the velocity, and the and hence the kinetic energy of thermally generated charge increases. If such ca charge carrier collide against an electron involved in covalent bond and creates newly charged carriers. The secondary particles are also accelerated and participate in collision that generates new electron hole pairs. This phenomenon is known as avalanche multiplication. The multiplication factor due to Avalanche effect is m is equals to 1 by 1 minus v by vd v bd whole power n where m is the carrier multiplication factor and v is the applied reverse voltage and v bd is the reverse breakdown voltage and n is empirical constant which depends on lattice material and carrier type. For n type silicon, n is equals to 4. For p type silicon, n is equals to 2. Due to this avalanche effect, the junction is said to be in breakdown and the current starts increasing rapidly. The diode have reverse breakdown voltage greater than 6 volts shows this avalanche mechanism of breakdown. Now let us see the CNR breakdown. The CNR breakdown occurs in heavily doped diodes. Avalanche breakdown occurs in lightly doped diodes. For heavily doped diodes, the depletion region is width is small under reverse bias condition. The electric field across the depletion region is very intensive, very intense. Breaking of covalent bond due to intense electric field across narrow depletion region and generates a large number of electrons is called Zener effect. What is Zener effect? Under reverse biased condition, the electric field across the depletion region, depletion layer is very intense. Breaking of covalent bonds due to intense electric field across narrow depletion region and generates large number of electrons is called Zener effect. These generally these generated electrons constitute a very large current and the mechanism is called Zener breakdown. The diodes have reverse breakdown voltage less than five volts. Shows the depletion shows the Zener mechanism of breakdown. This is the breakdown region of Zener breakdown. 
and this is a valence breakdown region. This is a graph of VI characteristics. Mainly these breakdowns occur in reverse bias. 